You should rest up while you can. Likewise. No, I'm good. Real good. <laughs> Besides, when I close my eyes, I start thinking about things. About people. Like Finn. Lazy little punk. Kid would do damn near anything, except what you told him. But ask him to paint you a picture, and boy howdy. No stamps in the tunnels. Finn's work. Everyone. Then there's Al, Intel guy. He had these tricks for stealing codes I still don't understand. Stole his share of hearts, too. But when it came to the ladies, he just had the one trick. Bouquet of flowers hidden behind his back. Funny to think, some of them might have even come from here. He pulled a flower trick on Tifa once, believe it or not. <laughs> she told him where to stick him. Of course she did. Our quartermaster Nellie had a good laugh at that. She was tight with Jesse. People sometimes took him for sisters, even. They'd say no way and get upset, but then they'd start giggling and, you know, Yeah, they'll all be fine. They're strong. They're tough. Like me. <laughs> After we save Aerith, I'll introduce you to them. Sounds good. <laughs> Never thought I'd feel better after talking with your hard-boiled ass. Think you can sleep now? Oh yeah, like a baby. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. <sighs> Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day, I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl, but not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. <clears throat> Daddy! <clears throat> Marlene. Where are you going? I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Hmm? <clears throat> Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? <sighs> and that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kinda... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. <sighs> You'll come back, right? 
Of course, a promise. <sighs> okay. You can go. She's tougher than me. All right, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. So, how are we supposed to get topside? With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. So what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo? My fellow grounders, listen up, because boy do I have some news for you! And it's assured to knock your socks so all the way into next one week. And five. What do the eco-terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako Reactor 7. Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage. The sky is falling and Avalanche is to blame. But wait! Did you know Wutai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums, they're nothing more than pawns of Wutai. Puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five gil. Five gil, come on. Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wu-Tai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want them, we got them. Uh, Does this mean there'll what? be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gil apiece, cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu-Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit... <clears throat> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what-ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't. I know we're short on time, but let's try to help out wherever we can. Hey, you! Cloud, right? Man, am I glad I caught you. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Mind helping us find them? Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down, they just up and bolted. I'm sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? All right. I think we can help you out. Oh, thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are Coco, Lolo and Momo. They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all.
we really have to deal with Corneo again? Got no other choice. What? Did you guys get into it with him or something? I don't want to talk about it. Huh? Hey, Cloud! What happened? Don't recall. I heard shouting coming from the mansion. Is something going on? We're not leaving the mansion. We're staying here. Hey, those officers, where'd they go? See all those Shinra troopers storming the dock? The Coliseum is Don't open for business and hungry. I heard them. No one's home. Long time no see. What brings you back here? Well, we need to find a way to get topside as quickly as possible. And we figured Corneo ought to know one. Is that so? In that case, I can help. You serious? Then tell us! Follow me. Hmm. Let's just hear him out. <clears throat> so, what's the deal with the hole? Unfinished business. If you three give me a hand with it, I'll give you what you need to get topside. You want us to go back into the sewers with you? What's down there? Corneo's hidey hole. That's where I'm headed. You're not gonna try to screw us over, are you? If that's what you think, walk away. I'll find somebody else to work with. And you'll have to find another way to get topside. All right, we're in. Say what? He betrays us, he dies. Fine by me. He means it. I'll tell you more after we've climbed down. When you're good to go, let me know. You guys ready? Okay. Follow me. Seriously, what's the deal with the hole? It's a trap for the Don's enemies. What? No one's ever gotten out alive. Well, until recently, that is. You are gonna hold up your end of the bargain, right? Long as you hold up yours, yeah. I don't trust you and I don't like you. So if you so much as breathe in a suspicious way, 
I'll turn that face of yours into a honeycomb. I'd save you bullets for the monsters if I were you. Some are a lot tougher than you'd think. Hate to say it, but I can barely take them on my own. You, on the other hand, shouldn't have any trouble. Am I right? Let's get this over with. Head for the trunk line. It marks the border with Sector 7. You three lead the way. I'll follow a short distance behind. ever do. Yes! <laughs> 
One step at a time, huh? Keep it up. Avalanche. Right. Jesse and Big stashed a skeleton key down here. I never got the chance to thank them for what they did. Tifa. Let's just keep moving, okay? Hate to interrupt, but the trunk line's just through that door. The one over there? Yeah, we heard you. Made it. About time. Should be a door with Hey, wasn't this locked before? Your time to shine. Clear the path ahead, would you? Yeah, yeah. Can I ask you something? Why did you help us out before? You could have lost everything. Andrea, you told me to. That really it? I couldn't bring myself to let it happen again. Huh? It doesn't matter. Let's go.
something personal. Let's do this. Getting close to Corneo's hideout. From here on, I'll take the lead. This is it? Yeah. So how are we supposed to get topside? Through here. Then you're telling me we're not done? Sorry guys, but it's not that simple. Without it, we're screwed. Let's go. Bastard went that way. I got it. Too late. What's that? like that, okay? I got gotcha. you. Give it all you got. Bring it home! Let's 
Give it back. That's... Give it back. That's not a key. Sorry. That's not your pendant either. Were they family? No. It was all just a dream, wasn't it? But one day? No. Time to wake up and forget. Six months ago. On that day, Corneo picked her as a bride, and on the next, she vanished without a trace. But before she did, she gave it back. Salt on the wound. Thing cost me a small fortune. Why did you want to come down here? 
revenge. I know I need to let go, but I can't. I need closure, because without it, I'll never be able to move on. It's fine. As long as you get us topside, we're still in. Thanks. And don't worry. I got you. <sighs> you all right. I know a shortcut. Follow me. That twisted piece of shit. I'm gonna enjoy beating him to a pulp. Corneo's mine, and mine alone. Huh? Please. Fine. Outside. Think the kid's gonna be okay going in alone? It's Leslie! Got some urgent info for the Don! Of course. Really? Without my little avalanche kittens? I thought I told you to round them up and bring them to me. Actually, it's them I came to talk about. Hmm. Uh. I need to remind you why I'm down here. Spilling the beans to those three escape artists was a serious mistake. Now I'm on Shinra's shit list. The plate stunt was meant to be an unprecedented tragedy, claiming countless innocent lives. But those naughty little kittens organized an evacuation and screwed up the plan. I'll let you in on a secret. Chinra is going to abandon Midgar and build something close to paradise. I was invited to be a part of it. Dawn of a new and improved wall market! I'll be lucky to live another week. <sighs> Leslie. I was going to let you run your own place. Give you a piece of the action. What a shame. Pop quiz time, kiddo! Villains like us only divulge our evil plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation, hmm? When you think you've already won. <laughs> Goodbye. Think again, Don. Huh? It's you. You were talking about the Sector 7 plan. Keep talking, asshole. 
Ah! Over there! Over there, look! Don't try to bullshit us. But that's the thing. It's not technically bullshit when it's true. Good, Abzu. Feel free to play with your food. Draw out. Master! First him, then Corneo. Now you're in for it. Give me your best shot! Nothing personal. You okay? Where's Corneo? Sorry, bastard got away. Uh, it's fine. I'll track him down eventually. Not like I have anything better to do. You know, I wouldn't be so sure about that. Huh? She could still
still be out there. <sighs> Can never be sure how much someone means to you till they're gone. Don't give up on her yet. Was it a message? What was she trying to tell me? <sighs> we'll meet again. It's a symbol of reunion. <laughs> then I guess I've got no choice but to find her first. <laughs> Thanks. Hold up. I think you might be forgetting something. I haven't. Found it. Let's get out of here, and then I'll give you what you need. That sweet Midgar small. <laughs> this way. <sighs> Grappling guns. You can practically fly with the souped up motors on these babies. Sector 7 is on the other side of that wall. The guns will get you over and past it, along with any number of other obstacles. But they're one-way tickets. So once you start up, there's no coming back. You should probably get your affairs in order, just in case. Thank you. Didn't tell you before, but we're looking for someone, too. That right. Hope you find them. You too. Ready to do this? Once we start up that wall, we won't be coming back here anytime soon. We won't be coming back here anytime soon. Better handle any unfinished business now, okay? <laughs> <laughs> 